Now, welcome to Foxtech and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you and guide you through the process of turning off or taking off the guided access from your iPad. Guided access is a great feature for keeping your focus on a single app, but sometimes you need to disable it. So I'm going to walk you through the steps. So let's get started. And at first, if your iPad has a home button, you'll need to triple click it. So if you are inside of the guided access, just triple click the home button and you'll get to this menu. However, for models without the home button, you need to triple click the side button instead. This action brings up the guided access menu, which is where you'll make the changes. Once you've triple clicked the appropriate button, you'll be prompted to enter your guided access passcode. That is in case you want to remove this. So it depends on what you want to do with this, but you're going to have the passcode. Uh, that one is going to be needed, which you used to set up you know, your guided access when you first did it. So go ahead and enter it. After entering the passcode, you'll see an option to end in the top left corner of the screen. So you can tap this and you'll disable guided access. Immediately, you'll be returned to the previous screen you were using before guided access was activated and it's as simple as that. Now, if you want to adjust additional settings for completely turning it off, you'll need to go to your iPad settings by opening the app and then scroll down and select the accessibility from the list of the options. Within the accessibility menu, look for guided access and go ahead and tap on it. And here you'll see a switch at the top of the screen you can turn it off entirely or just toggle it off and this will disable the guided access and ensure it doesn't activate again unless you manually turn it back on. So that's about it. Hope you found this video informative. If you did, make sure to hit the thumbs up, subscribe below and I'll see you in the future.